what's up today? I'm here with my soon to be sister in law, Jessica, and we are going thrift shopping, and you are coming with us. We go thrift shopping all the time, but yes. I feel like you go a lot more on your own, and you're pretty pro at it. Yeah, I like to thrift shop. Which is pretty good. You just have to get in and out before the allergy attack sets in, that's the key. Yeah. So, I'm very allergic to thrift stores, but yeah. love them. Oh, it's worth it. Actually, this Patagonia sweater I'm wearing right now is thrifted. Are you wearing anything thrifted right now? This denim jacket. Oh. My favorite denim jacket. Yeah. Cute. That's yes. a steal. Jessica, what is your like number one tip for thrift shopping? It would be to shop in any section. Like, don't limit yourself to male, female, little kids, like size-wise. Don't limit yourself. Just shop around because even if you find something like a men's extra large, it's gonna fit you yeah. like oversized and cute. I mean, you can also DIY things after, so like yeah, crop you can it crop or... things or like we've made denim shorts a million times out of the vintage Levi jeans. Yeah, like men's jeans yeah. too. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Oh yeah. Actually, the last section that I ever go into when I thrift shop is women's. Yeah. I look at the women's section last. I'm also a sucker for the knickknacks. You do like the knickknacks. I know, but I like to look at everything is my problem. What's your I biggest like, tip, Shelby? I think you really hit the nail on the head with like, yeah. don't be afraid to shop in different sections. Oh, tip. <laughs> look for textures. Like when everything is super close on the rack, just kind of skim, look for like textures that are yeah. like grabbing your attention or like colors that stand out to you. Yeah, sometimes you can't look through like a whole rack of men's shirts. So you just fucking, you know, we're not, we're not cursing at this. So you just walk and you see what stands out to you, like yeah. good fabrics, especially like in thrift stores, a lot of stuff is like overwashed or like yeah. kind of worn out. So like you can tell, like looking through a bunch of clothes, what's still good and what's good quality. Buddy? Sorry. <laughs> Where'd this building go? Oh, she's gone. She is gone. She anyway, right? we're here. We Let's are go. here. Where, where should, should we, oh, I, I suggest too, to set a game plan. Yeah. Because, well for us, where we're both allergic, we don't <laughs> last very long in these stores. Like, we could never shop here for a fast. full hour. Like, no. We Not like 20, in five minutes, 30 minutes, yeah. and then we're out. So, I like to like pick a couple sections I'm gonna check out. <laughs> oh, they look so cute on you. No blue them. light getting to those eyes. I know, I'm gonna wear them. They're honestly gonna help them. with the fluorescent lights in there. You, you gonna like it. I love it. Super cute. It's so rainy today, but we're still gonna send it. As soon as I see someone with glasses, I'm like, they read books. Yeah, right? Like, obvious. How many books did you read today? Yeah. Um, 12. Oh, yeah, I figured. They were all All right, cool. this is it. We here. Welcome to our thrift shop. Yeah, you, those are cute actually, but you look smarter in the pink ones. I know. Those are cool. These are cool. They match your glasses. <gasps> They're my glasses now. Oh. <laughs> oh. These fluorescent lights literally have nothing on these glasses. This is such a cute jacket. What the f We finished at Valley Village, only a couple sneezes. We are at location. It wasn't bad today. It wasn't bad. It wasn't bad at all. We actually did pretty good. You guys are gonna like what we got. We are at location number two. Louis Good used clothing. Clothing. Uh, Jess thought of another tip to share. I did think of another Get tip. Get in here a little closer. The other tip uh, is to shop out of season. So like it's winter now, but it's gonna be harder to find good quality winter pieces right now just because everybody would be looking for that. Like mm -hmm. 
like the more sensible type shopper. So we shop out of season. We just bought some bathing suits. So. Yeah. Because no one is thinking to look at bathing suits right now because it's like freezing. So yeah. And now then as the soon as the season hits, they'll all be picked through. Yeah. So you might as well just get it out of season. And especially right now, there's probably lots of good things because people are Marie Kondoing. I know. People are so <laughs> obsessed with that. And I was literally like the week that... I don't know. I saw a tweet that said that basically, like everybody get to the thrift stores because yeah. people are Marie Kondoing, and there was better shit. There yeah. was better shit. Last time I was here at Louis, I got this Patagonia jacket. So let's see what we get today. Louis always mm -hmm. has better prices than Value Village. Way better. Way better prices, but yeah. way less organized and just more overwhelming and more yeah. sneezy. Yeah, agreed. And Shelby has to pee, so we're gonna have to be in and out. Yeah. Yeah. Got to pee. Maybe they have a public bathroom. I'll ask. Yeah, I wouldn't want to risk it, but go for it. We'll find out. Gonna put my UV ray. Oh, what are they called? Blue light. Blue light lock. <laughs> Blue light blocking glasses. Oh. You look very cute. These with people those. need to know I'm serious. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think it's centered enough? I feel like it. No. We're back. We thrifted, we bought all the things. Mm -hmm. Really? Hi! She's so Hi. dying for attention. She missed us. We'll put her up here. Here, call me. Call me, you darling. I know. You were all alone all day, you poor baby. Looks like I just put her into nowhere. <laughs> yeah, just <laughs> drunk, drunk the floor. Sit down, sit, lay down. There. I got this super cute fleece jacket. It has drawstrings at the bottom, yeah. which is really nice. I really like it. I like this a lot. It feels it has pockets. It feels like it's not been like washed a million times too. Yeah. Like, it feels kind of new. Yeah, I like this. Yeah. And this was like I think five dollars. Is the tag down there? Mm, tag is the gone. tag anywhere. I think it was like four ninety nine, which is awesome for a sweater. Pretty cheap for Value Village too. Yeah, agree. Most of the times they're overpriced. It's a Columbia little fleece zip up. It's and it's just dollar. like, yeah, it definitely needs a good wash, but. Does it have drawstrings? It does. Oh, it does. Have drawstrings. Yes, ma'am. Nice. Love yeah. That. So that'll be good. I'm always like attracted to like Columbia or North Face. Because you know that those brands actually last. And their quality, and we're Canadian, so we need the warmth yeah. of it all. Exactly. It's yeah. freaking cold around here, man. Got this just plain like crew neck yellow sweater. It actually looks great on. Pretty, pretty good quality. Like it's still soft inside. It hasn't been washed that many yeah. times. No, it's just a fun color. Yeah. Yeah. I, I remember, remember I got like, one of these like in a bright purple. And yeah. I wear it a lot. Just and posing. again, don't be afraid of big sizes. This is an extra large. And I wouldn't want it any smaller. You yeah. know what I mean? It's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> T-shirt. Oh, I just thought it was fun. Us. Yeah, I know. It's just it says uh, Venice. Venice. Well, Venice. It's probably Venice, Italy. The gondola. Cute. You know that's the translation. But uh, it's just a cute little tee. Like I probably will crop it. Maybe maybe I'll just tuck it in. Yeah. You okay, babe? You're making some noises back there. <laughs> shirt. This is from the men's section as well. It's got all Chinese tags, so I don't know like the brand. It's just... Yeah. But cute little long sleeve, funky pattern. I think I'm going to crop this one to be honest. Yeah. I think oh. this is going to be a cute like crop sweater. This. I just thought this was cool because it's like Jurassic Park, but it's in like Japanese yeah. or whatever. That is cool. So I just thought this would like, I don't know. Even this in the summer, we put shorts. 
This one's definitely getting cropped. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. It is cool, though. It is. And that was, I'm not reading the prices. Three nine, yeah. three forty nine. I found this on my way out, like a little vintage bathing suit top. It's so cute! I love yeah. the color block. This was $3.99. And it's so 80s. Like, I know, yeah. right? The colors. The I have no idea. It's the not even legible anymore. because no. it's. So but I mean, the elastic didn't wear away. That's how you know it's not. New. That's key. They don't. Uh, they don't make them like they used to. They don't make them like they used to, no. folks. And then I got these bottoms because Shelby found them for me and they're like a large, they're like, they're a high waist, but mostly they're a high leg, which like mm -hmm. you can't really get that style as much anymore. These and the texture of these is so nice. It's got a little ribbing and it's like, it does feel like they're thick. expensive. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, what else? Oh yeah, it's Land's End. Never heard of it. And uh, They're good quality. Are they? Yeah. Never heard um, of but they're like bathing suits and stuff. But I just like the cut of these, and I think they'll just match a bunch of stuff. And they oh, were only yeah. five ninety nine. Black so. bathing suit bottoms you like can't go wrong with. Yeah, exactly. And this shirt for two fifty. It's a little Pac Man t shirt. Yeah, I like that one. I like that. So I cool. like this one better than the other one. You. She well, found two Pac Man I shirts. Know. But I ended up going with this one because it was cheaper. The other one was six ninety nine. This one looks more retro. Oh yeah, and the other one, the pattern went like all the way down, and I figured I would crop it, so, so I figured would I would go with the, this one. Yeah, way but easier to crop. Cute, very cute. I got this. It's kind of tacky, but it's gonna be cute cropped. Mm -hmm. It's ghastly. It's a Pokemon. And I just think it's gonna be like very. Just like a funky throw on shirt. Yeah, it's throw on shirt. Cool. Wear it to work or something. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I just kind of went for it because I like the color and the feel of it. It says Hog's Breath Saloon Key, Key West. West. But I got it basically for the back. Yeah, the back is pretty cool. And I don't know if I'm going to crop this because it's kind of short. I might just leave it and have it like tucked into I would shorts it. in the summer or something. You, you could, could even like just distress that one, like put a couple yeah, holes in it. That's, that's usually what idea. I do with the ones that I keep full length. I just mm -hmm. distress them so they look a little. It's a good call. Make Fire. it look a little bit more vintage, but yeah. the back's super cool. If anyone's been to uh, Hog's Breath, let me know. Yeah, let us know. This one is like super cool. I'm obsessed with this one. Yeah, this one's lit. So it's a Puma. Ferrari type racing shirt shell. or something. There's shit. It's Ferrari. literally it's like so cool. changing tires in a cockpit. This is what they wear, I'm pretty sure. I think. Anyway, it looks pretty dope uh, tied, up. tied up and like it yeah, it's, it's just a little it. intimidating and like it's a it's a vibe. I love it. Yeah. She got me to come out of the fitting room to look at this one and I stepped out and she had like the black cargo jeans and this like tied up. I was like yeah, you're buying that. That is lit. I love it. But it was $14, so. Yeah, I feel like. This is why you go thrifting. Yeah. They're like pieces that exactly. like you'd never pick that but no one else will ever have. Which yeah. actually reminds me of this that I thrifted like last week. Yeah. This is Cape Breton Breakers. This is a basketball team that existed in Cape Breton in 1992, I think it was. Which means this thing is like pretty much as old as I am. Me. Yeah, it's your age. Yeah. Pretty cool. I love it. I, I like it a lot. I think nobody wore it. Like this was in somebody's drawer forever. 
Yeah, so, like, considering it's white, right, and it's still that white, uh, I know that is pretty so, impressive. I feel like I need to do it justice, and like I gotta keep this guy good. Yeah. My last value village find was this denim jacket. This is Walmart Seven Two Five Originals. This is like Walmart when we were kids. Yeah. So it's a little bit big for me, but I'm gonna be able to make it work. Like it's kind of thick denim. I think but... we could crop it. Yeah. And we could have a saucy little crop jacket. And maybe like distress it a little, get some Javex much? and a spray bottle. Only thirteen ninety nine. That's actually not bad. Yeah. This is also the last time I was there. This is what I got. But uh, these are just, they just fit me really good. So I just wanted to show them today. They're just like a classic. That's a nice wash. Light wash. Um, they are Wrangler. They, I think I found them in the men's section. Actually, I found these in somebody else's cart. <laughs> you stole them? I did. Wait, what? Okay. You stole them in someone's cart and you snagged okay. them? Okay, the cart was abandoned. Okay. But I do believe it might have been somebody's. So it was like a sisterhood of the traveling pants moment, and I literally knew, looking at them in a cart, I was like, those are gonna fit me perfectly and I'm gonna <laughs> love them. So I, I was like, and I, I did, I took them right out of the cart, but I didn't see anybody around, so it was like, not a big deal, but like, well now you got these super cute jeans. It was a bold move. <laughs> It's like <laughs> this little copper, what would you call this? Like a decorative vase. Vase. Yes. A vase. A vase. A vase. A vase. Obviously, yeah. It's a nice piece of decor. Beautiful. Decor. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is also something I got last time at Value Village. This is just a cute little cheetah print because cheetah print's so back in now. Look at the ruching. Well, yeah, this is literally, this is vintage. Oh, this is yeah. old. Like somebody loved it. Somebody wore this to every party they went yeah. to. It looks really good in the boobs. It has some cool ruching, and I just think it's like, if you're gonna go cheetah print, make sure it's old. Hey, hey, I actually never bought shoes at a thrift store before, but I saw these in the uh -huh. bin when Jess was trying clothes on, and they're just like white Adidas sneakers, and they're just my size, so yeah. I went for them. I've also never bought any from a thrift store, but if yeah. something like that came up, and I they, probably would. They don't look too bad. Like These are honestly cleaner than my Converse right now, so yeah. I'm always White shoes it. are always yeah. good I'll to wear have. This is a Morona long sleeve thermal. So I think this is Target, right? Target, Target is, does yeah. Morona. Yeah. It's just like thermal, cute, long sleeve. And I'm actually gonna crop this one and wear it with like high waisted. Yeah, that's a good the, material the sleeves to Because the sleeves fit really well. Yeah. style on boy yeah this looks old um someone had that in their closet for years and never probably took it off. and just never took the tag off anyway it's just this cute little kind of bowler type i don't know collared shirt with a cute zipper and it's uh, got the elastic i like that yeah a lot. just be cute with jeans just look good easy. on me but it's cute <laughs> got this Tommy Hilfiger polo shirt. I love this color. I'm always attracted to like, what the hell is she doing? Maddie's getting aggressive. <laughs> so what happens when we leave Maddie for a few attention. hours. Anyways, Tommy Hilfiger, I'm going to either cut this and wear it with high-waisted or like leave it tucked in. But I like the color, I like the style, and it's Tommy so I know it's like good quality, it's gonna last. Yeah. That's what you have to look for when you go thrift shopping is also the brands. Like I would never buy something 
with a Walmart tag, other than that vintage Walmart jacket. <laughs> Collared shirt, men's, of course, by Brooks. like Brooks Brothers, whatever that is. Um, I feel like that's a fancy man brand. Yeah. Anyway, it's cute, it has a little zipper, and I think I probably will crop this. I like the blue collar. It's cute. Yeah, the blue collar, I that's thought nice. that was just nice and like different. Just something different, yeah. yeah. Nice little pop. And on the back, look, it says. Yeah, this part is really cool. Brooks. The Brooks. That's super cool. Yeah. yeah. I didn't try these on. Ooh, but those but are I think nice. they're gonna be fun. They're just like High quality. Adidas track pants. Yeah. You can't really go wrong. And they have like the elastic kind of tighter bottoms. So didn't try them, but I think they're gonna be fine. Just like a um, what's that print called? like alligator type yeah. print? Is it navy? I don't think. No, oh, it's no, black. it's black. And it's just a black belt. Yeah, I just thought it would be cute because I really don't have belts and I never look at belts in stores. But I and I like, feel like the prices mm. of like real belts right now are probably too, way it's not too much. Worth. Yeah, exactly. Um, these are pants I got again last time. TNJ. They are TNJ, <laughs> which I'm not proud of. But they fit really good and they're just like black cords. Now see, I need to get better at shopping for pants because if I saw this on the rack, I would never think to try it on. Yeah. You know what I mean? I know. But like, it's just corduroy pants and corduroy's really in right now. Like I textures have... are really in, yeah. so I kind of just got those. And they, again, they fit really good. I don't, those are cute. It's just, sometimes you just luck out and what you want fits. <laughs> This is from Louis. last time I went. It's a Calvin Klein size small like knit dress. Yeah, it's really good quality. There's no like pills or pulls on it. It would be cute like with a pair of tights and like boots or something if you're trying to look a little bit fancy yeah. in the winter time. But it's cute and good it's quality. It's warm. Like. It's warm. Yeah, yeah, it's thick. It's got a cool pattern too. Public pants. They were literally sitting on the top of the pants pile at Louis in my size, like size size 12, and those. they literally fit perfect. They're like so um, nice. they have pink, they have black like and beige. Yeah. But sometimes I see purple when I look at it. I think. Oh yeah, I just thought I saw navy. That's what I'm saying. It's like it kind of plays a trick. This on is your like eye. the black or gold dress. It really <laughs> is. Sometimes I see purple and gold. Sometimes I see like black and pink. Yeah, it's very weird. It is weird, but these are cool pants. Yeah, I like those. They're pants. very cool, and I was pumped about them because, like, I'm never gonna shop at Banana Republic. But yeah, seriously, I'll shop at Louis. Freak yeah. last time I was there and like it has pockets a little tie and the back is like a V it's pretty cute yeah. just for like hanging out around the house I would never wear this out ever but it's just cozy to wear yeah yeah something to throw on something to throw on Go. Go. Good. Yeah. Good. Do you have to be? No, I'm good. 
All right, you guys, that concludes our Come With Us thrift shopping video. Yes. Thank you for Thank coming. You for, thanks for coming. Thanks, thanks for, for coming. coming along. We had a lot of fun today. We hope that you guys had a good time. Don't forget that like and subscribe button. And let us know if you guys want to see some more of these videos because, like, we're down. We do it all <laughs> yeah. the time. We're thrift shopping regardless. So, yeah, so might as well. Let us know what you think. And thanks for watching. Bye. Nailed it. Nailed it.